What? See? My mommy mon wins. You know, you really got good at raising Digimon. <laughs> I had to, because when I was there, I had such a hard time. Uh, huh? Nothing. Are you talking about Digimon World again? Stop dreaming! I'm telling the truth, and nobody believes me. What are you saying? So Thorin is at it again? Hmm. Alright. Uh, will you register my Digimon? Deliver where? Hey, where are you going? Where? Where else? The Digimon World Tournament! All right, enough of that, enough of that, enough of that. Hey, it's me, Thally, or Eric, whichever one, doesn't matter. And as the last winner of the Digimon World Tournament, I think I know a thing or two about how to make a Digimon. So I'm gonna guide you in how to make your upcoming tournament entry. Yeah, follow me, come on, let's go. All right, so here we are, we're on the Digimon World Tournament. Beetle Cup is going to be the next one, so this isn't going to be for everyone, but it is going to be for this one. I'm going to have this uh, particular document linked below, so if you want to make your entry, follow along, and all the information and everything you'll need is, in fact, right here on the screen with us. For the TLDR, which is basically what we're going to be going through. To participate, you're going to need to create your entry with the entry creation tool, which you can find here, or the tools are on page three. There's a Discord server. We're going to go over that, and if you have questions or if you just need to enter, this is the person on Discord that you're going to need to know. So yes, first things first, you will need Discord and an internet connection, but I thought that last one was a given to participate in the Digimon World Tournament. And here's uh, the foreword, here's the Discord server, and all the other introductions. So, a Beetle Cup, which is only Insectoid Digimon possible. Finishers are going to be allowed, Poison Slow is going to be disabled, and Over Stat Limit is going to be enabled again. So the default 999 is not the default for this. Now, to participate, you will uh, need to make your entry and uh, submit it to Sothorin on Discord with the mes uh, message here or react to the participating if you're on the uh, Discord server. And uh, you use the web tool to create it. The end time right now is Monday the 17th of July 2023. So if you're watching this in the future, the process should still be the same on how to create an entry for this tournament. But um, yeah, for now, you have precious little time. Two days. It's going to be held on Zathorin live stream, and depending on how many entries, there may be other people. I've uploaded a copy of the tournament that I was in and I hosted this last time, so if you want to know the vibe, go ahead, take a look. Uh, Beetle Cup, we already went over that. Stat restrictions, 10,000 points are what you're limited to, and that'll become clear whenever we go over the um, registration tool. Restrictions, uh, if you want to have an empty move slot, you need to have 750 brains. Uh, up to two non-poison status effects, so you can have Dot, Confusion, or um, 
or stun. And those ones, uh, you can have two different ones. If you have poison, you cannot have another that. And uh, poison damage has also been upped on this. Uh, this rule is not in effect at the moment. Uh, here are the restrictions for the moves. So they've redone all the stats for all of this. And then we've also got buffs. So buffs will do things and they are explained here. You can see what each of them does. And here are the reasons why. Uh, and here's all the tools and other things. Now, let's go ahead and go over the tools, shall we? Luckily, I had them pulled up. And we're going to build my Digimon right now. Because why not? Let's have some fun. Uh, we're not using Seedramon. I'm looking at, uh, let's see what Tentamon can use. Can he use Mass Morph? He can. Uh, we cannot use Bug. Bug is generally banned. Bug Encounter, so... Aha, uh -huh. so Tentamon I cannot use. Uh, let's see, Kuwagamon. Okay, so he's got Poison Claw, there's Mass Morph, and... Okay, and you can only have one buff move at, the, at a time, so there's that. So let's go ahead and put uh, Poison Claw in second, because I want to put Poison Claw in second. I'll put uh, Mass Morph up one, and then I can't use... wait, I can use Sonic Jab. Alright, yeah, those will be fine. Uh, let's enter our name, because I haven't in a while. No, I don't want to fill it with any of those. Thank you, Chrome. That is the username. I will go ahead and use the real name for the tamer name. Stat points are correct. And... Yes. We are now Beetlejuice. Um, I want 1,000 brains for 2,000 speed. Or wait, no, I can't use 2,000 speed for mass morph, can I? So this needs to be 900, so that means for this I need 450. There we go. My defense is limited because of Mass Morph. What is it limited to? And what's my maximum offense? I'm not using Poison Powder. Insect Plague is not a bad one. Uh, so my defense is limited to 25, okay. I'm gonna put up my, my offense up to 3,750. I can still use three, okay. So now let's do this. Because 2,500 is the limit, right, for defense, yes. And now the rest is going into HP and MP. So HP I want at... And then I don't have enough for MP, so I'm going to have to pull down... Let's pull down brains. Yeah, now we have 140 more, so if we put... So that is a fully made Digimon, but let's see how it works in our damage calculator, and I may reduce my attack a little bit. So, we've got our Digimon, we're not uh, getting the entry just yet, and yes, you can uh, still download a memory card and see how it works on the original Digimon world or the patch because there is going to be a patch. Um, but uh, I don't know if that's going to be released to people, sadly. And then uh, we'll just go ahead and copy for the damage calculator. Okay. Now we're into the damage calculator. I had uh, my... Let's see. 
Why is this doing what it's doing? Annual input. There we go. So, we chose a Hercules Kabuterimon. No, we just chose a Kawagamon. Alright, now our Kawagamon had what stats? 10,000 health. We have very low MP, but that is fine. 1,900 MP. Um, our offense is 3,750. 3,750. Defense is 2,500. Speed is 900, and brains are exactly 450. Now, let's swap to Muscle or Sonic Jab. Poison Sting. Poison Claw. And Mass Morph. Now, I'll be honest, I'm not looking necessarily to win by anything other than being annoying. Because I don't think that I'm going to be able to uh, actually defeat any Digimon from even the last um, tournament. So let's go ahead and put myself up against Nedaim. There we go. And he is 100% absolutely going to win if he hits enough with Thunder Justice. Megalo Spark, not so much apparently. Uh, we need to go ahead and put on our Mass Morph so we can get up to four. So let's see what happens once we put on our four. If we hit to four Mass Morph, we can actually win with Poison Claw. That is surprising. But uh, let's say they had even one full potential. Uh, we still win. How do we still win? Let's go up to three, which he can use uh, up to six. Yeah, and that's whenever it starts to get outstripped. Uh, but let's go ahead and hit five. Yeah, no, he starts to win hard once the full potential comes into play. But since we're not fighting against a machine Dramon, it gets a little bit easier. Only one person, I think, had an insect, or no, uh, Kunamon. Who was Kunagod in that one? Takami? Yes, it was Takami. He had no buffs, so let's go ahead and do that. Oh wow, that Megalo Spark still hits for a mint. Even with my max buffs. Yeah, no, they were expected to win. Um, but this is what I would expect for my particular entry for this. I don't think we have a lot of anything, um, but both of these are very fast and Mass Morph is going to give me more defense. Uh, the poison is also going to help, the effect chance of 40%, so we're likely going to poison, it's going to do damage. The bu uh, poison damage is going to do a lot more than we'd think, so I'm going to bring my attack down. No, I'm not. Because the only thing that that would do is allow me to put more into HP, because my MP is good. I can use it 30 times in a match, and I'm not likely to use it 30 times in a match. Your MP is allowed to be low, it's based on how many times you're going to use your most powerful move. And since I'm not really using any powerful moves and have things that cost a low MP, then my stats are going to be, you know, easy enough to contribute. So, the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to hit Get Entry. Copy to Clipboard, cool. Then I'm going to head over to Discord and message to the Thorin. Okay, I hope that was uh, simple enough. If you have any questions, feel free to DM uh, Thorin or Fleegan first if you're having any like technical issues. If you want help on like building a creation, I'm available too. Just drop a comment down below. Uh, if you're planning on joining the tournament, please, by all means, let me know. And uh, that'll be awesome. 
hit a thumbs up if you enjoyed like all the things uh comment if you need to and uh if you want more digimon world stuff if you want more tournament stuff just hit a subscribe and i'll see you next time peace